survive in there. These are droid control consoles. Let's see what this little guy can do. found an exit. Good. Grab some of those crystals and get yourself out of there. This place is giving me the creeps. Lord Dasan, this is Admiral Fire. Ah, uh, Admiral Fire. How go our experiments? As of this moment, they're not going at all. The testing facility on Kajim has been neutralized by a pair of New Republic mercenaries, and they've taken some of the crystals. Mercenaries? <laughs> Judging by their ship and the conversations our cameras picked up, I believe it was the pilot Jan Ors and her mercenary partner Kyle Katarn. Katarn, eh? This sit-back could prove to be the answer to all our problems. I'm afraid we haven't been able to decode any more of that transmission. Good. If I put the Valley of the Jedi behind me, so can the rest of the galaxy. So what were the Remnant doing in that lab? Our scientists believe that they were trying to artificially infuse the powers of the Force into living subjects. Those crystals you're holding are very much like those found in a Jedi's lightsaber. Spast! But that's impossible, isn't it? You can't just give people the Force with a machine, right? Everything we know about the Force tells us that such devices are nothing but the fevered dreams of fools and madmen, Jan. But try telling that to those poor beings you found in that laboratory. Who were they? Colonists from Artis Prime, a remote mining world in the far reaches of the New Republic's influence. Let me guess. Crystal mining. Yes. We lost contact with them shortly before receiving the transmission from Kejim. Now we fear that the colony has been captured by the Remnant. Or worse. Indeed. Without knowing the full extent of the Remnant's plans, or the colonists' plight, the New Republic is uneasy about sending in a full Liberation Force, so... So you'd like us to sneak in, assess the situation, and call in the fleet if necessary? Yes. You know I don't like messing with this Force business anymore. We'll double your usual fee. We'll take it. 